Are you working from home, but tired of the same old work routine? Or is your space at home too loud, too small, or even lacking a proper internet connection? Well, working remotely from public spaces might just be the solution you're looking for. But hold on, before you grab your laptop and head to the nearest library or coffee shop, let's dive into the benefits and drawbacks of this lifestyle. In this complete video, we'll spill all the tea on working remotely in public settings. We'll show you how to choose the perfect location, evaluate Wi-Fi networks, stay safe online, and set up a comfortable workspace. So grab your favorite drink and let's embark on a journey towards ultimate work-life freedom. Working remotely in public can be amazing, but it's not all sunshine and rainbows. On the bright side, being around people can boost your productivity and open up networking opportunities. On the downside, social isolation and noise pollution can be major challenges. Plus, privacy concerns can make things tricky when handling sensitive information. Choosing the right public setting is crucial for success. So, let's pick a location that suits your work style and ambiance preferences. Need silence? Hit up a library or a cozy coffee shop. Need some background buzz? A bustling cafe might be your vibe. And hey, comfy seating and the right noise level are a must. Once you've found the perfect spot, it's time to evaluate the Wi-Fi situation. No one likes a spotty connection that keeps dropping. So check the signal strength, network reliability, and bandwidth capacity. Oh, and make sure there are no pesky restrictions that might limit your online access. Safety first people. Speaking of safety, let's ensure you're secure while browsing on public Wi-Fi networks. We don't want your personal info falling into the wrong hands. Use a VPN to encrypt your data and avoid connecting to networks without Wi-Fi encryption. Hackers, be gone! Now that you're safe and sound, it's time to set up a secure workspace. No shoulder surfers allowed. Find a spot where nobody can physically access your device or eavesdrop on your conversations. Adjust your screen and use privacy screens to keep sensitive information away from prying eyes. Your workspace, your fortress. To stay focused and minimize distractions, let's master the art of time management. Create a schedule that suits your productivity peaks, use timers to stay on track, and prioritize tasks to avoid lingering thoughts. Trust us, it works wonders. And hey, finding ergonomic furniture is key to avoiding those nasty backaches and maintaining good posture. So look for adjustable seating options and don't forget to take care of your eyes with proper lighting. We don't want you squinting or hunching like a turtle. Now, let's pack our essentials. Your laptop, charger, keyboard, mouse, and any other gadgets you need should be in your go bag. Oh, and check the power sources nearby to keep those batteries juiced up. Noise-canceling headphones and privacy screen filters are your secret weapons against distractions. Keep your secrets secret. While you're working, remember to establish boundaries with strangers. So politely decline conversations when you're in the zone. Focus is the name of the game. But hey, we're not hermits. Dealing with noise and environmental factors can be tricky. So grab those noise-canceling headphones and find a cozy corner away from the hustle and bustle. Natural light is great, but don't let it blind you. And if the temperature is off, layer up or bring a fan. It's all about balance. Maintaining a professional image is important too. Keep your phone on silent, avoid loud convos, and dress appropriately for the setting. Good body language and communication skills go a long way in public spaces. Remember, you're not just representing yourself, but also your work and your profession. Taking breaks is essential for your well-being and productivity. Step away from your workspace, stretch your legs, and give your eyes a break from the screen. Public spaces often offer great opportunities for short walks or outdoor breaks, so take advantage of the surroundings. One challenge of working in public is the potential lack of privacy. Be mindful of your surroundings and take precautions to protect your confidential information. Avoid displaying sensitive documents or confidential files in public view. If you need to discuss sensitive matters, consider using a private meeting room or stepping outside to maintain confidentiality. Another aspect to consider is the availability of amenities. Public spaces like libraries or co-working spaces may offer additional resources such as printers, scanners, and meeting rooms. Familiarize yourself with these amenities and make use of them when needed. 
Networking can be a significant advantage of working in public spaces. You never know who you might meet and what opportunities may arise. Strike up conversations, attend networking events, or participate in community activities to expand your professional network. Building relationships and connections can lead to exciting collaborations or career opportunities. While working remotely in public spaces can be liberating, it's important to establish a healthy work-life balance. Set boundaries and define specific working hours to avoid burnout. It's easy to get carried away when your office is everywhere, so make time for personal activities, hobbies, and relaxation. Lastly, always be considerate and respectful of others sharing the public space. Keep noise levels to a minimum, clean up after yourself, and follow any specific rules or guidelines set by the establishment. Remember, you're sharing the space with others who may have different work styles and preferences. So, whether you're in a bustling cafe or a serene library, working remotely in public spaces can provide a refreshing change of scenery and valuable experiences. Embrace the flexibility, seize networking opportunities, and enjoy the freedom to work on your own terms. With the right preparation and mindset, you can make the most of this exciting way of working. Happy remote working! Head over to our blog wfhb.com for more useful work from home tips.